Over 35 years ago, the T.J. Martell Foundation was born as a dying wish from a son who fought leukemia. He asked his dad to raise a million dollars for research so that no one else would have to suffer like he did. Since those early days, the T.J. Martell Foundation has raised over $240 million nationwide to battle leukemia, cancer, and AIDS through research. The Honors Gala in Nashville was a black tie affair that brought together many community leaders to help raise awareness and funds for research. Kelly Lynn caught up with a few of the honorary guests before the big evening. Mayor Dean here tonight, and you're going to be honored with the Spirit of Nashville Award or the T.J. Martell Spirit Award. Talk a little bit about, too, the, how Nashville has come together in two years now that they've done this, they've raised $900,000, and just how the city and you being patted on the back tonight feels. Well, this is a great thing for our city that we're able to put on events like this, and, and no one's surprised. I mean, Nashville's a very generous city. We are a city where um, there are a lot of people who are interested in volunteering and helping for causes that help the public. And this is a good example of it. The way the city reacted to the flood's a good example of that, too. And it's not really about patting me on the back. It's about honoring the city of Nashville and the people of Nashville for what they did to recover from the flood, how they volunteered, they looked out for each other, they showed the right spirit and I couldn't be more proud to be mayor of the city it's just a great city tonight you're here in Nashville getting ready to perform at this big event talk about what you're gonna perform your new bluegrass music or? we're gonna play one of the bluegrass songs and we're gonna play a classic stick song but in a little a little more of a Nashville style All right. because the guys in the band are all just the best players in town and I said Let, let's don't try and sound like sticks you guys are here let's sound like us here tonight and so we, we've come up with another arrangement for it that's like a lot of fun. A special version just for tonight and I see you have the, the attire Nashville style you ran into just, Manuel. Just put it on yeah we went over this this afternoon and uh, ran into Marty Stewart over there and we're because we have mutual friends and have known Marty for a few years and you know he always looks great. It's my first time in there as he was leaving he went in the back and he walked out and handed me this jacket and it, it just about was fit me perfect, but uh, Manuel took it in, and here we go tonight. Scott Hamilton, talk about being in Nashville and being at tonight's event. Everybody's here from ice skaters to country music stars, and, and T.J. Martell, and what a great organization this is and the research that's done with the money. Well, since I joined the club in 97, you know, I, I try to support, um, you know, anything that that is really making a difference in the cancer community, and, and T.J. Martell Foundation, I mean, all over the United States, the world, I mean, they've, they've really made a huge impact on fundraising for cancer research and and its programs and so um, to, for me to be it's the first time I've done a TJ Martell event in Nashville and um, it's a pretty heavy crowd so um, I, I'm very impressed and and uh, I'm excited about the evening as far as tonight's event, do any of you have any personal connections to T.J. Martell Foundation or any cancer survivors or people that... Yeah, we definitely have family members who have um, had cancer, some who have passed away, some who are struggling now, and some who are survivors, so even AIDS too as well. So um, that's that's our personal connection to it. So, you know, we definitely support it, and um, we're glad to be here. As a cancer survivor, you're doing great. Oh, really? Yeah, you know, I, I, I joke that I have a, an odd hobby of collecting life-threatening illnesses, but... And I hopefully I'll take a few years off and uh, just get get well again. Um, you know, cancer is something that can happen at any time. I didn't, I didn't, it wasn't like somebody sneezed on me and I got cancer. It's just something my body decided to do. So I preach vigilance, you know, just keep in touch with what's going on in your body. And, and women are much better at that than men. Um, and I tell men all the time, you know, it's not, I'm not saying that something will happen. I'm just saying that if it does, you want to get to it early and then it's just a bump in the road um, you know it, getting to things early it's still the best cure for cancer is early detection so um, I, I that's the one thing I mean, events like this make us talk about it and um, you know I, I was stage three when I found mine and I was in denial because I figure if I'm on tour and I'm athletic and I'm healthy and if I'm throwing backflips and triples I'm not gonna get sick well I, you know I got cancer and um, you know I, I, I was able to um, you know, deal with it. I was a perfect patient um, and get back to my life quickly, but it was still three months of chemotherapy and, and a 
pretty big surgery. So um, again, if I would have paid attention to the signals that my body was giving me, I probably would have gotten to it a lot earlier, and it may have been a much easier road than it was. Good advice. But you seem to have a great sense of humor and keep laughing, so I'm sure what, that helps. What choice do I have? <laughs> Good answer, good no, answer. It's well, great. Life it's, is great, you know, is. and we got to be able to laugh at ourselves, especially when you're, you know, short, bald, male figure skater. You know? <laughs> we love it. We love you. Thank you so much. If you would like more information on the national organization, please check out tjmartellfoundation.org. We still have lots more ahead right here on Inside Music Row, including a special backyard performance. We'll explain right after this. We're Mountain Heart. You're hanging with us right here at the Music City Roots House Concert in Nashville, Tennessee. Y'all stick around on Inside Music Row.